How's it going? Uh, welcome back. Wow, it's been a long day and that went right to my head. All right, well, I wasn't done fin reading this magazine and I still got this. Hopefully it's good. Uh, come in and see a thought. The Mark Ultra uh, 13 E meter is an instrument which measures emotional reactions by tiny electrical impulses generated by thought. Um, it gives man, capitalized, his first look into the heads and hearts of his fellows, L. Ron Hubbard founder. Wait, I think it's Mark 8, not Mark 13. A V in Roman numerals, that's 5. Sorry. Uh, come in today and see a thought. Cutting edge. How long has Ron been dead? Uh, take a self-guided tour of our public information center. You are welcome to tour the displays at your leisure and stay as long as you wish because they're lonely over there. And you know something? I drive past this org. This is something you don't see. You know what you see? That place minus the people. <laughs> you do see some people sitting at counters, drumming the, their fingers on the tabletop there. There's not much going on. They, they've got two Scientology bus benches out front, and they've moved the table out to offer stress tests, and the guy's sitting there. I got it on video. I'll, I'll add it to this, just to make my point at the end. All right. It answers any and every question you may have on what Dianetics and Scientology are and what they can do for you. It's our public information center. I should do that, go in there. They'd probably fall over from shock that anybody came in. Uh, and you can come into the church anytime and take a free self-guided tour. I'm going to insist on a self-guided tour. Stay the fuck away from me. I'm looking for myself. I've only been into one org, and that was the user bathroom. They were nice enough to let me take a piss. That was a long time ago. They had all these bus, you know, bronze busts of uh, L. Ron Hubbard. I'm like, how many busts of this guy do you need? They were probably plated. Uh, the Public Information Center includes more than 500 videos. So you better stay a while. On everything we do, who we are, and what we believe in. Including Xenu? Just wondering. In the Galactic Emp Empire and it, what, DC-8 space planes? <coughs> it provides a complete introduction to every aspect of Dianetics and Scientology. Thing that they're two separate things, apparently. <sighs> Including the beliefs and practices of our religion. It is well... Wait. It has as well a biographical presentation on the life and legacy of L. Ron Hubbard. All right, I might just have to do this. I'll take a barf bag with me just in case. Uh, it includes a section on Dianetics, providing more information on how it works and what it can do for you, and showing testimonials from individuals who have, who have benefited from Dianetics. I've seen one of those videos. Uh, the Modern Science of Mental Health. The Public Information Center further includes exhibits on many humanitarian incentives, uh, initiatives, humanitarian initiatives, and community outreach programs our church sponsors Come in and make a journey of discovery today. We are open seven days a week, Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. Saturday and Sunday, Sunday, uh, 
9.30 to 6 p.m. Well, I don't see much going on there. And I drive by there all the time. It's near where I work. The Public Information Center at a glance. Over 500 videos on everything we do, Dianetics, our beliefs and practices, the life and legacy of our founder, Elwan Hubbard, our humanitarian uh, initiatives, and community outreach programs. That's it for this. And this is what they sent Mom. Some glossy paper and with this light it's reflecting off. So let's see what they mailed Mom. Don't have my letter opener. Uh, uh, screw it. Rip. <laughs> All right. And this is from Larry Parker. I wouldn't say the guy's name, but he put it right on the envelope for everyone to see. So there you go. Let's see what they sent Mom. All right. Oh, she gets different stuff than I do. Hello, Donna. I am Larry. How are you? This is all printed out. Uh, Got to cover up Mom's address. Look at that. Nice, easy to read print. I get scribbled cursive. It looks like he's having an epileptic fit. Um, can I tell you... Wait. Can you tell me what happened with your Dianetics book you bought back in 1997? I doubt Mom bought a book from you. Uh, she says she didn't. Uh, did you read it? 1997? You're shitting me. They are desperate. Have you used any of the techniques to help your family and friends? What questions do you have about it? I've, I've been to her place. I've looked at her bookshelf. I don't see any Dianetics books. Some Seventh-day Adventist shits and uh, some Our Daily Breads and shit like that. But Mom's religious. But no stuff from Dianetics. Scientology. I'd really like to know. Please write or call me back, okay? Love, Larry Parker. And look at the signature. He's even incorporated a smiley... That's kind of creepy, Larry. You don't even know my mom and you love her. Well, they sent a self-addressed envelope, so maybe I will mail them something. Let's see. Hmm. This is different. Dianetics. The modern science of mental health. Indisputably the most widely read and influential book ever written about the human mind. I doubt that. <sighs> Blow away the barriers to happiness with this explosive bestseller. Huh. Containing discoveries hailed as greater than the wheel or fire. Dianetics has remained a bestseller for more than 50 years and can be found in any thrift store for like 25 cents. Lots of copies there. And with over 20 million copies in print, generating a movement that spans virtually every country on Earth, it's indisputably the most widely read and influential book ever written about the human mind, like you said before. Here is um, the anatomy and full description of the reactive mind. The previously unknown source of nightmares, unreasonable fears, upsets, and insecurities which enslaved man capitalized. I thought that were th those are thetans. 
I guess you have to get a little higher up before they tell you about that. Except the words out. Thank you, Internet. <sighs> All right. This book shows you how to get rid of it. And your reactive mind. Get rid of your mind. Just the reactive part, huh? Hopefully not the reasoning part. <sighs> and so achieve something man capitalized <coughs> has previously only dreamed of the state of clear capitalized. <sighs> Among the discoveries herein the goal of man, because that's why we exist, is because of a goal. And a goal without a plan is just a wish. Uh, the dynamic principles of existence, which is different than the goal of existence, I guess. Uh, the one word that motivates all living things, survival. Um, oh, they didn't tell us. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've read Dianetics. It was awful. The four dynamics that drives upon which all life are compartmented. The uh, descriptic graph, descriptic graph of survival, revealing one's true potential and how to achieve it. Maybe not financial uh, potential, because you'll be giving all that to these people. But, hey, you'll be happy. And not burdened with all that money. You know, that you could buy a house with, like me. The discovery of the complete anatomy of the reactive mind. The painful experiences in grams contained in the reactive mind, which command one to act irrationally against their own wishes and goals, like joining this church, for instance. That would be bad. The impact of prenatal engrams. Prenatal? Really? Well, it's not as crazy as reincarnation, but it's pre-incarnation. All right. Sorry, that prenatal thing threw me off. Um, <laughs> what took place before you were born and how it's influenced you ever since? Mom had Pop Rocks. It fucked me up. She drank Pepsi with Pop Rocks. Or maybe it was Sprite. I don't know. Dianetics enables you to discover and eradicate these harmful experiences so you can... so, so, so they can never affect you again. Revealing the one person you've always wanted to know you, <laughs> whoever you are, uh, Dianetics, the modern science of mental health, available in hardback, paperback, audio format, 16 CDs, and, and it's 704 pages of raving bullshit. Uh, Dianetics is an adventure. It is an exploration into terra incognita. The human mind, that vast and hitherto unknown realm, half an inch back of your foreheads. <laughs> L. Ron Hubbard, you're such a clever guy, Ronnie. Couldn't make it as a writer, but he made it as a cult leader at least. Yeah, all right, let's see. Yes, send me free materials, uh, my free material guides right away. You know, in a chart. And look, they even pre-checked it because they knew you were going to want that. <sighs> a 
Well, Larry, if you're watching, Larry Parker, my mom doesn't want any more shit from you, but you can send it to me. I think it's fucking funny. She just gives it to me unopened and tells me to scribble out her address, so I'll read mine, I'll read hers. Hers is actually a little more interesting than mine. Anyway, maybe you might want to get clearer and you're a little different than I am. I feel clear enough already. So, I might have helped you out, and if so, I want you to let me know. Or if you learned something, uh, I think maybe a little dynamic tour is in order. What do you say? Well, I am going to include this with a drive-by I did of uh, the Ideal Org on a Sunday at around 3 p.m. Uh, nothing going on. It's funny, we had a union rally that went by because uh, a place where I was working, we were having a contract a while back, and we marched by with signs and making noise, and we went right by the front of their the Ideal Org, and they were... There was nobody in there except Scientology drones, and they all went, Whew. thought they were for us. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to close with some video I took. Peace the fuck out. Have a wonderful whatever the fuck it is you're having. Scientology is definitely on a decline. Bye. Bye-bye, Scientology. Go away. Fuck off, Scientology. Here's the Scientology org. They got Scientology benches, and look, they got a guy sitting outside now. <laughs> Used to be they were on the mall. Now they got to sit in front of their own place.